This is the stress thermometer, SC911. It's a digital biofeedback thermometer that can help you learn how to relax and how to measure your temperature so that you know instantly what your stress level is. To unpackage the stress thermometer, simply remove it from the plastic case and the unit. Once you take it out of the package will be like this. You have a battery. So with your thumb slide down the battery door, insert the battery, and I'm going to put the little leg down to hold the digital thermometer upright so we can see the readings. The end of the wire has a thermistor or sensor and this will measure your temperature. So you can simply hold it between your fingers very lightly and you can see instantly the temperature increasing. It's measuring in Fahrenheit 84.4 degrees, 84.8, 85.1. There's no audio feedback but you can see that it's updating every two seconds. This is critical if you're going to use it in biofeedback, relaxation, meditation, to be able to see what the changes are. One, you'll be able to see yourself tense because your temperature will drop. Your hands will become cold. Oppositely, you can see yourself relax as the temperature increases and begins to get warmer and warmer. What I'll do is I'll pull off a strip of tape I'll make a little tab on one end so it'll be easy to pull off when I'm done. Just place it over your fingerprint right hand or left hand just so that it holds it comfortably on your finger. And you can see while I did that, my temperature dropped a little bit. Also, when you ha hold it between two fingers, you're kind of have a little bit of a thermal blanket. You could now listen to a recorded relaxation exercise such as some of the exercises that we offer on progressive relaxation, autogenic phrases. They teach you how to scientifically relax, how to let go, and how to let the temperature increase to your hands. Some of it sounds as simple self-programming. My hands are warm, relaxed, and warm. I can feel my whole body relaxing and my hands are warm. Since I'm recording this video, I can see that my temperatures are a bit cooler because I'm concerned about the outcome and how well it will teach you about this simple device. But I just wanted to cover the basics in this video so that you saw how to unpackage the unit, open the back door, insert the battery, and attach it to your finger. This is a, a remarkable tool. I know it's very simple, but it is modified and adapted so that it has a research grade thermistor that responds very, very quickly to temperature changes. And you don't want to touch the thermistor on the end of your finger. You don't want to touch that to the tabletop. You don't want to touch it to your legs or some article of clothing so that you're getting a clean and clear reading. The advantage with the stress thermometer is that it measures the full range of stress. So in other words, some devices only measure like 9 degrees. Hand temperature 
can shift and change from 60 up to 98, possibly even 99 degrees, depending on the situation and the reading. So that's almost 40 degrees. For some of you, that temperature range won't be that dramatic. Just a few degrees will reveal how stressed or how relaxed you are. The nice thing with this device is that you can record your temperature and track it and see what those changes are over time. So you have a number value. How stressed are you as you get ready for paying your taxes or heading off on a holiday vacation to visit relatives you really don't care for in a place you can't stand? Or, in contrast, what happens with your temperature when you're heading out for a dream vacation, going to some beautiful, beautiful island in the middle of the ocean with sandy beaches, or maybe even just staying home with a number of days to kick back and relax and be at ease. So I hope that you'll give this digital thermometer a try, and I'm sure that you will find some amazing results for yourself. It's also fun to test other family members, co-workers, to see what happens with their temperature and what's going on. Thank you for purchasing the stress thermometer, and I'll be posting more videos with more training ideas soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.